Hi there, I'm Alana and this video is part of my minimalism series and today I'll be cooking with you um, up a minimalist lunch that um, yeah it powers me up for the rest of the day so I can start dinner. Yeah, so anyways what, I'll, what I've done here is I've prepped and cut up some lettuce and this is dual purpose because I'm going to use this for our family's dinner. And um, now I'm just going to take a big handful of this prepped lettuce and put it in my lunch bowl here. Yeah. And here I'm just going to turn on the light. I think it might be better for this video. Whoop. Oh, hopefully that might be better. Okay, there. And um, okay. So now I'm gonna just chop up an avocado, which I know that the proper way to do it, which I figured out a while back, ooh, is to just go around it. Uh, and this one has been in the fridge for a little bit here, so it's got kind of a piece I have to cut out. But anyways, so you just have it, and then you're able to take the pit out, which is poisonous, with the knife. And I'll put that into the compost here. Yeah, so um, just cut that piece out. I'll need a spoon anyways, because that's the best way I find to get it out. Um, we'll just chop, chop, chop. I'm just slicing inside of it so it comes out easy, easily. And like that, like that. Okay, good. Now, here's the bad. Right, bye bye. And you know, you might get a really fresh avocado from the store and it might have the same silly thing, right? Because that's just natural food and what could sometimes happen. Now, little Anna doesn't like avocado or, or Gabriel definitely doesn't. So I don't always put it into the main master salad mix for dinner. So I'm that's why I'm filling up my bowl separately. I think just like half, I guess, half the avocado is good for now. And supposedly if you save it with the, um, with the skin like that and put it in a bag in the fridge, then it will brown less. So I'm going to try that. Um, good. Now I'm just going to cut up some cucumber here that I have. I had a bit of leftover. Anna is a cucumber monster. She's always <laughs> eating up all of our cucumbers, and that's great. We like that. So I just, I sliced it in two, and then now I can just sort of do this. Yeah. Okay. There's nothing, like, really too fancy going on here, because, I mean, keep in mind, this is me on my own trying to get house jobs done, and I just want a really healthy lunch that's going to kind of give me a lot of energy to get through the rest of the day and make dinner and all that stuff. And I'll put some cherry tomatoes into, the, into my bowl. Um, again, with the kids, I don't think I'll just add anything more to that right now. I might add cucumber later to their bowl. Yeah, this is an interesting shaped apple. Anyways, so it sits here. Um, yeah, I'm not going to use that one. Ah, of course. Ah. Okay, quickly, quickly get another apple. Wash, wash, wash. There we go. Okay. Apple number two. Now, yeah, I'm just gonna like slice and dice up this apple, really kind of somewhat finely anyways. Medium. Yeah, toss those in. Okay, and you know what? The family really likes apples, so I'm just gonna continue to slice those and put them in the dish for later. And that's going to go with this mushroom barley risotto that I'm making today. The compost is full, so I actually have to put this apple core in the garbage. Oh no. Uh, 
Um, yeah, so a bit of sunflower seed for me. Um, a bit of sunflower seed for the family. They like those. complain about the taste of feta, which is ridiculous, right? Uh, children. So, um, so this is my lunch here, and I'm just going to dress it with this lovely uh, fresh garlic Caesar dressing from La Maison. It's actually um, something that we purchased at Costco, so that's kind of a, a great store that we get most of our groceries from. So they have organic sometimes, a lot of the time, and then sometimes they don't. So we just kind of work our lives around whatever seems the freshest and most natural. Yeah. Got to toss, toss, toss that up with a fork. Or even with two. <laughs> that one now. Okay, so voila. So this is my minimalist lunch <laughs> and my first minimalist cooking video. So there. Well, happy Tuesday, everybody. Thanks for tuning in. Remember to hit subscribe to Alana Shamka on YouTube. Thanks.